Stock market crashes, in a nutshell. The stock market is usually a growing market, at least long term. From time to time there are big crashes, in which stocks lose significantly on value. What drives this phenomenon and why does it happen regularly? According to a widely accepted definition, it is a crash, if the broad market loses at least 20% from their highest point. A crash is often caused by external economic events and is driven by panic. Usually, big players sell a significant amount of their stocks. This leads to decreasing share prices, which motivates more shareholders to sell their shares, intending to save their money. This leads to even lower prices. Usually, crashes are a result of four conditions. 1. A prolonged period of rising stock prices and excessive economic optimism. 2. A market where price earnings ratios exceed long term averages. 3. Extensive use of margin debt and leverage by market participants. 4. Wars, large corporate hacks, changes in federal laws and regulations, and natural disasters within economically productive areas. Now that you know the indicators of stock market crashes, you can always evaluate these factors and make better decisions for investing. Of course, we all dream of buying shares really cheap and selling it high like a Warren Buffet. And of course, the stock market is a complex construct, but at least you know now important indicators. Evaluating these can save you from investing at the worst time, quite before a crash. Feel free to use your new knowledge to increase the performance of your investment. Share also your opinion about these factors with me in the comments. If you liked this video, I would be happy to get a like from you. Subscribe my channel for more interesting topics. Until next time.